Hey guys, my name's Chris. Welcome to the channel. What's your sin of a day or sin of a night? Drop your comment down below. Today I'm going to give you my top five blue fresh fragrances for 2024. I have a lot of blue fragrances. You guys know that if you ever meet me in public or know me personally, I talk about a lot of blue fresh and clean fragrances because you can wear them in any scenario. We're talking about spring, summer, fall, winter. You can wear them to work, casual date night. They're more on the fresh, clean or citrus um, side of things where they're fresh and clean. Some have grapefruit, some have neroli vetiver. They're fresh fragrances that nobody's going to be offended by. And a lot of time, people don't like people wearing fragrances. But if you're wearing something fresh and clean and elegant, they're going to like the way you smell. Whether they're in the fragrances or not, you're probably going to go on our comment or two down the road. What are your favorite blue fresh fragrances, designer niche or indie? Drop your list down below. Before I start my list, I do have three honorable mentions. I talked about these fragrances of death, so I don't want to put them in this video here. So we have Uncut Gem by Frederick Moss, a nice fresh fragrance. Some people said it smells like a Blue de Chanel or a Dior Sauvage-ish. I get it. It's a fresh and clean type of fragrance. A little more on the pricey side, but definitely check out Frederick Moss Uncut Gem. Definitely check out Louis Vuitton. This is Afternoon Swim, my friend Jerome's favorite fragrance. He rocks the heck out of this one. He's got a we get his bottle refilled very soon, but this is a very fresh citrus blue fragrance that you can wear spring, summer, fall, winter. You can go ham on the sprays. These are magnetic caps, and these do last a good four to five hours on the skin, depending on your skin chemistry. And most people like this fragrance. It's definitely a mass appealing, fresh and clean fragrance. Last but not least, my favorite fragrance. You guys know about it for now. It's a Dior Baby, Dior Sauvage. You can hail the fragrance all you want. It's a fresh and blue fragrance or shower gel-ish, and it lasts longer than any other fragrance I talk about on my channel. So definitely check out Your Sauvage by the House of Christian Dior. Number five fragrance for now is the PDM. You guys know Parfums de Marley. If you're new to the fragrance game, you may not know that, but it's okay. This is Sedley. Beautiful bottle presentations. We have notes of spearmint, bergamot, lemon, grapefruit, lavender, geranium. This fragrance here opens up very fresh. You're getting a nice bit of freshness from the bergamot. You get a nice bit of uh, grapefruit as well. And it's definitely in that range of like a Blue de Chanel, Dior Sauvage ish type of fragrance. It's fresh, it's clean. The added spearmint is very nice touch note to this fragrance here. They did reformulate this in a bigger bottle, in a 125 ml bottle. Performance is great. You're going to get easy seven, eight hours on the skin. I current formulation only get about three or four hours, but you can go ham on the sprays like this and It'll get you a good four to five hours on the skin. This is one I like wearing it dressed up or dressed down. It's a casual spray and go fragrance. Just grab it and just spray it. And you know you're going to smell fresh and clean throughout the day. And a lot of people like this fragrance around me. It's not too strong, but it's a nice scent bubble around me. And this is great for any occasion, any situation that you're going to in life or walking into in life. Definitely check out Perfumes Amari. This is Sedley. Number four fragrance is from the house of Navitus Parfum with creator director Steven from Red Lesson. So shout out to Steven. This is Navis. Beautiful bottle presentation. Has notes of bergamot, grapefruit, neroli, orange, and vetiver. This fragrance here is great. So this was Steven's first creation of a Navitus brand. It's a very blue, fresh fragrance. Some people kind of get more of a lemon. You definitely get a lemon freshness to this. Some people say they get a lemon pledge like a fresh laundry detergent. I get it. Some people get that vibe or cleaner, but it's more of a fresh and clean fragrance that you can grab and go and you're going to smell fresh and clean for several hours. A very beautiful, elegant, fresh fragrance. And I love when this one, guys, put a nice heavy dent in. If you see the little dent, I got a dent about here, about that far down. It's an amazing fresh fragrance. I wear it to work. I wear a date night with Kelly. I definitely wear it when I'm running errands because it's fresh and clean. I do about one, two, three, four, five, six sprays. And it gets me through the day, you know? It definitely has a similarity to other blue fragrances on the market, like a Blue de Chanel, a Dior Sauvage, a Rosa Parfum, Elysium. You kind of get that DNA in this fragrance here. It's not the same, but it's a very elegant, fresh, and clean fragrance. You should definitely check out Navitus Parfum. This is Navis. Number three fragrance from the house is Chanel. They have a lot of amazing fragrances. This is from their blue line, Blue de Chanel Parfum. Beautiful bottle presentation as well. This has notes of uh, bergamot, mint, lavender, geranium, sandalwood. I love the magnetic cap. Sprayers are beast mode. This opens up, you're getting a lot of freshness, right? You're getting freshness from the bergamot. You're getting some lavender, getting this geranium, slightly minty touch to it. It's a fresh fragrance, but it definitely is a calming blue fragrance. It's not like the EDP or the ET. It's more smoother, uh, 
more easier to wear. It's not aggressive in your face. It leaves a nice C as well, a nice cloud around you when you're wearing it. And people get close, you're gonna love the way you smell. I've got compliments wearing this one when I'm in close quarters with people at work or just at their house. They love the way this one smells. I say it's a very elegant, gentleman, fresh and clean fragrance. Performance is great. I'm easy getting eight hours plus on my skin. This performs the best out of all the Blue Day Chanel flankers. And projection good for the first two hours, but it's not beast mode. It's moderate, but you're going to catch Wassel when you're walking around running errands, and people are going to love the way you smell. If you want a blue gentleman fragrance, it is pricey, but if you get this, this could be your signature scent for everyday wear, date night, casual. Definitely check out Blue Day Chanel. This is the puff on version. Number two fragrance is from the House of Rosier. They have a lot of amazing fragrances. This is their newest release from their flanker before. Rosier Parfum, this is Elysium O Intense. Beautiful bottle presentation as well. Look at that. And this here has notes of lime, grapefruit, musk, rhubarb, bergamot, lavender, apple, and vetiver. So this fragrance here, beautiful. Now for me, I tell people my full review, which I'll leave at the end of the car if you want to see it. I get a fresh and clean laundry vibe. There's nothing wrong with that. Does it sound weird and funny? Yes, for a laundry detergent as a fragrance, but it's fresh and clean. Women like those scents on guys. It might sound weird to you guys out there, but guys, listen, women love that fresh, clean fabric softener vibe on their man because you're fresh and clean. There's nothing wrong with smelling fresh and clean throughout the day. I know you take a shower, but that still doesn't last all day. You got to put a fragrance on to smell fresh and clean for the rest of your day. And this does go on compliments and be careful because I did five sprays. I felt like that wasn't enough. But apparently people said it was very strong off me in the first hour to two hours on my skin. So it has very nice projection. And I get about six hours or so of longevity. Have no complaints. It's definitely a great upgrade from the original Elysium Cologne that came out. You, either one you get, you're going to smell great. This is very great for a fresh, clean laundry detergent vibe. I love the fragrance. I love the presentation as well. And man, I love the beautiful cap. It's very different. It's not your plated gold. This fragrance is great if you want to smell fresh and clean slash laundry detergent vibe. Definitely check out Roger Parfum. This is Elysium Intense. Number one fragrance is from the house Louis Vuitton, baby. LV, that's my favorite brand. This is my favorite fresh fragrance from the Louis Vuitton brand. I have a lot. You guys know what it is now. This is Meteor. Beautiful fragrance. So this is a magnetic cap. Amazing sprayers. This has notes of bergamot, mandarin orange, Sicilian orange, neroli, pink pepper, cardamom. There's a lot of spices. And this does have a similarity to a Blue Day Chanel or Dior Sauvage, but definitely more of a high quality fresh fragrance with the note of the Mandarin orange, Sicilian orange, so a lot of citrus and freshness with the added touch of the Neroi, which is very beautiful. I love Neroi and fragrances, so obviously I'm gonna like this. And there's note of vetiver. And there's a little bit of this nice bit of uh, sweetness coming from the cardamom and spices in that as well. This is a beautiful, elegant fragrance. It is expensive, but I've worn this one four times in a row and I receive a comment each time I warn it. So it is a comment magnet type of fragrance, but don't go into it. Think you're going to get comments every time you wore it. My situation life are different than yours. I'm very easygoing, talking to people, always got a smile on my face, just enjoying life. This is an amazing scent, guys. If you like afternoon swim, if you like imagination, definitely check out Meteor. It's my favorite fragrance, guys. A 10 out of 10. I wear this one dressed up, dressed down. There's not a wrong time to wear Meteor. One of my favorite fresh fragrance from Louis Vuitton. And if I didn't have a lot of fragrances, this would be my signature scent. And I buy myself a 200 ml bottle. These are refillable as well in 100 ml and 200 ml. If you want a fresh and blue fragrance, some people say it smells like Azaro Chrome. Nevertheless, it's an amazing fresh fragrance. Definitely check out Meteor by Louis Vuitton.